Lawrence Bakery burned down yesterday. His business is toast. <laughs> Along with all the rest of our freaking businesses, we're all toast. Like super charred toast. No one has the money to buy anything anymore. Right? Plus prices keep going up. Some of us can't even afford to feed our families. All of those clergymen and aristocrats lounge about tax-free. <laughs> Why do we have to pay taxes while the church and the aristocrats don't? It's unfair. Right? This is ridiculous. The nobility doesn't even let us come for food. I've been doing a little reading lately, and I think that we deserve more of a voice in the government. Plus, as for Jonesy, I think that I should have some trade restrictions to be lifted. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. My team, the French government can barely afford to operate. We're still in debt from the Seven Years War and from supporting the revolution in America. Yeah, that really sucks. I tried to tax some noble books so we could pay back some of the money we borrowed, but it just got kind of busy. Hey, Louie, I'm going to buy this ridiculously expensive hat, okay? Sure, baby. Anything for you. Hey, call in a state's general, maybe. The government is pretty much at a state still. So. Oh, my king. France hasn't called all three states together since 1614. That's okay. If I call all of us together, maybe we can agree about adding some of the taxes. We'll meet here at Versailles. Scene three, meeting the state's general and the national assembly. Uh, bonjour, c'est Louis Lasset. Welcome to the state's general meeting. We are at Le Clergé, the first estate, the highest class in La Trois is class. We are the nobility, and we are the second estate of the La Trois. Okay, and we the cousins support the bourgeoisie, and everybody else make up the third estate. Okay, attention, we are going to have a vote on the government's financial problems. We need to figure out how we're going to charge, uh, charge and levy taxes. We're going to vote by estate, right? No, we should vote as a whole. It's more fair that way. And eh, how about nah? That's not gonna happen. Why don't you take a small break? Hey, why is the door locked? Let us in. Sorry, you made me mad. So you are no longer able to vote. You dumb idiot. Let's go. We'll find somewhere else to go and vote by ourselves. We're gonna make our own assembly national now. Let's take the tennis court over. That no matter what, we will pass a new constitution. Scene four, see the storming of the Bastille. Attention, troops! I need a cartoon to go to Paris. Okay, all the food riots. This is propaganda. We must fight back. At least to storm the Bastille. of pips, Greek blacksmiths, and butchers, gin of poor pots, if you scum. Yeah, but we have pitch, yeah, but we have pitch forks and butcher knives and tools. this way from Paris. These peasants are starving and now they have come to attack the palace. Uh, let's give us Jason Jason Let us see the king. They must not get into the royal family. Stop them. Uh... 
We will take the royal family to Paris and hold them in the Tuileries Palace. We are the, they are the, our prisoners now. Down with the monarchy. Now that King Louis the, the 16th has been executed, we will kill his wife Marie Antoinette and end this monarchy. Off with their head. Now I declare France a Republic now. Anyone who has a problem with that will pay the consequences. All traitors will be executed by the Committee of Public Safety, led by me. Over the next years, the Committee for Public Safety executed hundreds of thousands of people for the smallest offenses against the Republic. Um, I don't like this new government system. Uh, ah! I will kill you too since you were a big hit. Oh no, don't kill them. <laughs> Mass killings went on until 1974 when the Committee of Public Safety rebelled the act against Robespierre. Um, enough with Robespierre, kill him. Dang it, we the director of the elections, but we cannot give up power. Um, no, we hate to leave, we will follow you. Well, then you're going to get whipped. We are in power. <laughs> oh, um, no, I am in power. Who are you? Who are you? I'm Napoleon, your new emperor. Here to fix this mess. First things first, Catholics, I negotiated with the church, and now you have the Concordat of 1801. You can practice your religion freely, but women, go back and sit with your husband unless he says you can interfere with politics. Don't. When Austria and Prussia faced humiliating defeats from France, they became allies until they were defeated by Spain and Portugal, who were assisted by Britain, resulting in Austria and Prussia leading the alliance. They attempted to invade Russia, but that didn't work out. Without being able to defend in Paris, Napoleon fled and then returned and was defeated at Waterloo, but finally executed in St. Helena in 1820. Okay, there's a revolution in France. Maybe we should get some freedom. Um, give us freedom. Um, guys, let's get organized here. If we're going to make a change, we have to be organized. Who are you? I'm Chassant Leauter, the man that will lead you to freedom. Yay! Um, no, I will not let you free the slaves in free St. Domingue. We are, we need slaves to work the sugar plantations so we can make money. Then we will make you seize over control. Hold up, if you agree to meet with us, we might be able to no negotiate about freeing the slaves, okay? Thank you. With this, we can have peace. Um, just kidding, arrest him for treason. Ha 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 ha. 